who do you think who do you think in the league right now today really has like I'm talking for real for real because I've seen a lot of names get floated where it's like they're they're not gonna be the face, bro. Like who legitimately has a chance to become the next face of the NBA? Cause I got a handful of guys in mind. So this is the thing when I when all right, because the face of the league thing is not just about like we're talking about just face of the league. It's not just about best player in the league. That's a big no. thing, though. But it's not like Jokic, per, like no disrespect to him. He will not be the face of the league because he doesn't want to be the face of the league. He's not right. He, he, he doesn't even care about it, which is fine, by the way. 100 percent. But you, to be the face of the league, you have to you have to want to assume that that role. Right. Know? Right. It takes on responsibility. You are like literally like you're every, you're everything. As far as, like when people think NBA, people think of you. You know what I mean? You sp- right. speak about stuff. Like your word has weight, like holds weight around the league, things like that. Super, you gotta be super marketable. So like a guy like Jokic is is out of it. Um, I honestly think a guy like Giannis, I don't, I don't know, I I don't even know why, because I feel like he's like he's not completely unmarketable. Like he's funny, like in his little dad joke way. But I don't know, yeah. I just don't think if I had to pick someone, it wouldn't be him. If I had to, I think his issue is he's he's too old. Like, by the time LeBron retires, Le- like, Giannis will probably be, like, let's say two years from now at the yeah. earliest LeBron. Giannis will be in his 30s. That is true. Yeah, they probably got to be a young, young. Right. Guy. I just think he 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 overlaps too much. I feel you. I feel you. But personally, the number one person who I think will be the face of the league is Wimby, for sure. Because that is, like, my number one, number one answer. He's checked every box. This man be having great quotes. Like he's got he's got everything you would want out of a face of the league top type player. And he's already kind of got the the grip on like the young NBA fans Mm -hmm. being the ridiculous seven foot five highlight real demigod type player. Mm -hmm. Like he's already got that type of appeal. He does great on the microphone. I'm here in San Antonio. They be, he does commercials for HEB, which is like the supermarket chain. He's funny. Like he'd be after games giving insightful quotes. Like he's got it seemed like he would want the, it. Right. He's got all the things that you will want to become the next legitimate face. I can't even see a guy like Luca doing that because you don't see Luca no. having that type of presence like that. But again, that comes down to a do you want to have all of that extra stuff? And if you don't, like genuinely, that's no knock on them. Cause honestly, if I was in their shoes, I wouldn't want to be the face of the league. I don't want to have to do all this extra media and all that. Even like whatever extra would come with it, like my money off the contracts, if I'm already that good to even be in consideration, bro, I'm good, bro. I'm mm-hmm. making like 200 M's, bro. I'm straight. I don't need all that extra on top. But if that's something that you do desire, like. Credit to a guy like Wemby. Like, I think he genuinely could be that next guy to – and he would be the first international face, like, that's, really, if you think historically. That's what I was going to say. Because one – one Wim, and also to add on, Wemby's game will like, – I, I think everyone knows, like, there will be a point where he'll be the best player in the league because his impact on offense and defense will be insane. It'll be soon, bro. It's it, going to be sooner than you think. It's going to be in a, in a few years for sure. <laughs> but I was going to say because do you think the face of the league has to be an American player? Because No. I, I almost would venture to say the NBA w- would be better for them to not, you know, give a little nudge, you know, a little extra couple of social media posts here and there to trying to prop up an international pr- player because the game internationally is – better than it's ever been and it's only getting better and it's going to probably like exponentially get better with a guy like Wemby in the NBA like Wemby is genuinely a direct byproduct of the fact that the dream team went to France in 92 Mm -hmm. like the type of global impact that that had but even deeper, the type of impact that that had in France, because the Olympics just happened to be in Paris that year, like basketball boomed there as a big result of you have guys like Magic and Larry and Charles and Michael Jordan, like going and playing in France. And so it's like, 
I, I think they would be it, it would not surprise me if Adam Silver in the league like kind of made a conscious decision to like really try to prop up a guy like Wemby. Not saying that he's not they kind of deserving are. of it. But no, yeah, like he's definitely deserving of it, but it seems like it's mutually beneficial for them too to be like, Yeah, we got an international guy like that can really be the face of our, our league. Like, let's push that so that we can get even more international talent going, even more international growth. You get more international fans, you get international dollars. You know what I mean? Like mm -hmm. it's a win, 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 win for everybody involved. hundred percent. hundred percent. I just think it's a uh, be interesting. The hundred percent. If it was a international player, cause like I said, it would just grow the league even, even bigger than what it is now. If I would say though, if like, I had to pick someone who was American because all if you think about all the best players in the league are international. It's just it is what it is. Like I said, the international the game is, three, yeah. is, is is better. It's the best it's ever been. If I had to pick someone who is American, who has potential to be the face of the league, to me, it's Anthony Edwards. Like, because I think we talked about it. He's so young. He's already at the point where. Like we, you see the talent. Like you see, I believe, I believe a lot of people believe he will, he can be the best player on a championship level, a championship team. If not now, then like obviously he will grow into that. He plays on both sides of the ball. Mm -hmm. The biggest thing though is like the character, the the the, the right. charisma. Like that, I feel like that plays a factor. Like people will like you, and also I think your game in a way, has to, like, match face of the league. Uh, the, it has to work with the face of the league, right? Like, Wimby, like, 7-5, can shoot, can dribble. Like, bro, like, come on. Like, what are we talking about? Right. It's an attraction in itself. Anthony Edwards. We just talked – we literally just talked about his highlight reel being better than a lot of people's career highlights. Like, the dunks, the high flying, the blocks, like, the clip. Like, that's another reason why I got, like, Jokic. Even if he wanted to be the face of the league, it would just be tough because his game – to, I think your game has to be appealing to the casual viewer as well. Because a lot of casuals know that, like, bro, LeBron dunk, like, prime LeBron is flying around, dunking, blocking. Like, that's good. Mm -hmm. That's entertaining to the casual viewer. Same with a guy like Anthony Edwards. And also to the casual viewer, like, bro, you see someone at 7 5 coming up the court shooting from the logo, like you just did. You're like, bro, what? what is that? So I think <laughs> literally. <laughs> so I think your game also has to match the face of the league. And I think that Anthony Edward would have that potential. If, like I guess if it had to be an, uh, an American player, but I do agree with you. I think it probably would be better for the league. If it was a guy like Wimby to step up and be the face of the league. Yeah. They, they would be able to do things internationally that the NBA has never done before. And I, even if it fully happens organically, like he just genuinely continues to ascend at the rate that he is and becomes the player that we believe he's going to become very soon. Like we're right now today, as of this is March 22nd, 2024. What is Wemby? Is he a top hundred player? Is he a top 50 player? Like just that. Uh, yeah, yeah, no, I, I'm just starting super vague. Cause I, I think right now today, he's probably a top, 30 feels right. 25 might be pushing it a little bit, but I think I could probably make a good case for him to be a, a top 30 NBA player right now. I think I think 30 is a lock. I think he's easily a top 30 player. I think I can argue my way for him to be a top 25 player. I think by the by, by this time next season he's he, he's probably top 15, bro. I put put it this way too, because I seen I forgot I, I always forget who <laughs> I will be watching a bunch of videos. I always forget. I never get nobody credit. I'll be feeling bad. Cause I don't be wanting to steal nobody's takes. But a dude was like Wimby has taken leaps throughout this year. Like you know right. how guys make leaps like next season. All right, he like he's now he's more efficient. Next season, all right, he added the three ball. Like Wimby has made yearly leaps within his rookie year. Yes. Which is like that's why when you say like bro he will be the best in the league soon like I wholeheartedly believe that because bro the improvement just from this year alone is ridiculous. Mm -hmm.